Hi YouTube, this is Lumari here, and this is just a quick update uh, regarding my channel and obviously VGC 16. So uh, as uh, quite a few of you should be aware by now, the VGC 16 rules were released a few days ago. Uh, among them, uh, the most important change is being that you can now use previously banned legendaries. So you can't obviously use mythical Pokemon like Mute, uh, Victini, etc. Uh, but you can use, obviously, Pokemon such as Mewtwo, Ho-Oh, uh, Primal Groudon, Primal Kyogre, Rayqu uh, Mega Rayquaza, and uh, the the last mentioned three are obviously going to be very predominant in the metagame, I think. Now, uh, I'm going to actually leave a few articles in the description to a few guides um, <clears throat> that show, you know, uh, from Nugget Bridge that pretty much go through some of the mechanics of the new metagame. Uh, and yeah, like it's, it's actually a very, when you think about it, it's a very good game. And I think this change uh, is good because we've got no new game announcement as of yet. And it's pretty much, it's better than, it's a better compromise than having VGC 15 again for a second year. And that's never pretty much been VGC historically. Um, you might be able to argue that 2012 and 2013 were similar, but obviously 2013 you had Black and White 2 with the addition of their move tutors and move changes. So VGC from year to year has always tried to be different from the last. And yeah, so if you've played uh, Battle of Legends or any of the other legendary tournaments which allow you to use uh, any of the legendaries that are new to the format, uh, you should feel somewhat at home. I had a previous, I actually do have uploads, I think, from the Primal Battle and uh, Battle of Legends on this channel. Uh, Battle of Legends, I believe, when it was on Battle Spot, you could use Transfer Pokemon. Obviously, in Primal Battle, you could not. So there is a little bit of a difference there. But yeah, with Primal Battle, um, I think I identified that Landris Incarnate was an all right counter to Primal Groudon a majority of the time. Earth Power, Life Orb could, um, with max special attack investment, could always one-shot. Oh, most of the time, not always, but most of the time, provided uh, Groudon had no investment in special defense or some HP. But um, obviously, the metagame is obviously still in its infancy right now, so it's, um, you know, a lot of things need to get developed, and yeah. Um, so I suppose the next, next part concerns my channel. Um, now, currently at present, if you want to play VGC 16, you can do so on Showdown. Showdown has a ladder for it. Uh, the, <clears throat> the, uh, what was I going to say? The, obviously the cartridge does not have any rules for VGC 16 as present. I suspect that the game would be patched to, uh, pretty much have its rules set. Exactly, because I think... Yeah, I was, I was reading another post on Twitter of someone, and I was like, it makes sense that the rules on the cartridge would be updated with a patch. Because I think that some some rules are a bit few and far between to emulate an exact VGC 16 rule set at the moment. So yeah, in yeah, pretty much bottom line is the best play the best place to play VGC 16 is on Battle Spot. And yeah. Now um <clears throat> yeah. Now, this is the part that pretty much concerns my channel. I'm pretty much going to, I think, start playing VGC 16 on Showdown and start posting that because I don't uh, I don't see a need or have, you know, that much motivation or interest to continue playing VGC 15 on Battlespot when we know we have a new format that's coming out. And I'm probably going to try and get some best of threes uh, on the agenda as well. I know I've been meaning for a while with... Um, Obviously, I've finished my studies, um, but I have been doing a bit of work as well. So it's just temporary work, but um, I actually haven't I'm yet, yet to have like a solid amount of free time, uh, you know, like a few days in a row or anything like that, if you will, uh, to produce content that much lately. But I do want to get some best of threes in using this new rule set. Um, I am going to start posting some showdown content uh, based around VGC 16. And yeah, and I think it should be good. And I think I'm going to do some analysis as well. So I think it's, yeah, I think analysis will be important. I mean, I know other VGC YouTubers, 
uh, like Aaron Zhang are looking at doing analysis. So I'm like, okay, I may do some analysis as well because, yeah, since the metagame is still relatively, you know, in, a, in literally actually in its infancy, it really needs a lot of development. And I think analysis uh, for a lot of people will be a uh, keen, keen interest, especially if they're uh, newer to VGC as well. So again, guys, uh, thank you for watching this quick update video, uh, and I'll see you in the near future. Take care.